What is up guys, Kevin Hurley, Riz coming back at you with another haul today. We do have 1.2 pounds of DC and Marvel superhero figs. This one I did pay 181, so a little bit more than $100 a pound. Uh, but it is all just uh, superheroes. There's some big figs in here as well, which probably took up quite a bit of the weight. So <laughs> probably way more than uh, 100, uh, 100 or a dollar per fig. Well, not way more, but slightly more than a dollar per fig. We're going to go through this. Um, I really need to stop buying superheroes because I have so many of them. But uh, sometimes, sometimes you just still buy them anyways. <laughs> if your name is Kevin and you work for Leg Bros and you have a problem. Comment below what your favorite that you see in this video is. Uh, Stores.ebay.com slash legbros where you can find all this stuff. Instagram, legbros with a zero if you feel so inclined to contact me or sell me your collection or just give me all your clones. That PO box will be down below in the description uh, of the video. So, you know, if you if you feel like you want to give me all your clones, you know, that's fine. I'll take them. That's all right. Uh, or your superheroes. You know, I'll take those too. Ninjago, I'm not picky. You can just give me everything you have. That's fine. I'll take it. It's all right. If you do, just want to get rid of it, that's okay. Uh, so let's go ahead and go through these. Uh, we're going to go through the big figs, big figs first. Well, say that 10 times fast. Big figs first. Big figs first. <laughs> I thought this guy was fake, uh, but then I had to look him up and uh, he actually does have this form. It's one of the newer forms of the dark blue legs here. Uh, so this is Hulk. I don't know what his value is because he is brand new, like I said. Um, I couldn't find him originally when I typed in Hulk on BrickLink, which is kind of weird. We also have Herc Hulk with Herc. <laughs> we got Herc. Hulk with purple legs. Uh, not the, well, this is purple decorated legs. There's also a purple shorts version of him. Uh, this one in particular is fake. I was wondering if some of them were fake and some of them were real. Um, just because superheroes are one of the most commonly faked ones out there. This is a really good fake, uh, but it is fake nonetheless, so we're gonna put that down here. I think this is probably the same. No, this was the, actually the real one. Um, so there's the difference in coloring, you can see. This is the tan pants one, and this is not. Uh, so we're gonna put some hands on him. These are obviously fake hands. Um, man, they did a really good job making these, though. Like, really good job on this fake. That is That is very, very, very good. Um, but anyways, we'll put him down here. We also have another Hulk, uh, which is really cool. This is the Ragnarok version of Hulk, which is one of my favorite superhero movies of all time. Thor Ragnarok was just amazing start to finish. Love that one. We do also have Green Goblin in his giant big fig form here as well. And these are both real, so that's okay. These aren't really worth very much, unfortunately, for a big fig. Um, some of them are worth okay, some of them are not. That is not very good. Uh, one of the newer Thanos ones, the giant hammer. Don't remember what this one came from, but I think it's the newest form of him. And then we also have another form of him as well that actually is real. So we'll have to find his arms as well. Hopefully there's some arms in here. <laughs> we'll see. Uh, we'll have to get these out of the way. There's huge, huge figs. This one is definitely a ting. I don't know this Thanos might be. We'll put him down here just as it might be because he's cool and I haven't gotten him before. Maybe that dark blue one is too. I'm not 100% sure. Uh, we do also have Iron Man here, one of his newer forms. Uh, there, usually those go in the ting pile. We'll just leave it up there since it's so incomplete. Uh, we have Superman. Uh, of course, we have our, uh, uh, what is it called? The Spider-Man 3, I think is what they call that. The dark blue, one of my favorite forms of Spider-Man. Uh, the dark blue, I just, I just love. I like the dark blue, I think, more than the light blue. Uh, but that's my favorite form of Spider-Man. Not sure what this one is at all. I uh, haven't seen that one before. I'm guessing something with Aquaman, but I have no idea, just from the scales. We have Deadshot, that's a pretty pointless one. Here's another ting of the day. This is actually classic TV show Batman, I believe. Hopefully the rest of him is in here because that is a fantastic find. If that's what I'm thinking it is, I'm pretty sure that's what it is though. Uh, he's got like the Speedo <laughs> on there. So pretty sure that's what it is. Hopefully we find the rest of him because that is a fantastic find if that's the case. We have Scarlet Witch. She is always a ting as well. She sells very quickly, especially with WandaVision out now. People are looking for those. I think this is the mini Thanos. Uh, not 100% sure though. We have Kiss Batman, which is uh, not worth a ton, but it is a really funny one. Uh, or not, sorry, no, this isn't Kiss Batman. My bad. This is the uh, uh, Apocalypse Burke Batman, I think, right? I don't know if they remade it in a series as well, possibly. But I think that's actually a pretty good Batman. Uh, I don't think it's a ting, but uh, we'll, we'll put it up there. Uh, I think that's Power Man is what that one's called. Light Blue Batman. Don't sleep on Light Blue Batman. He's actually a very good find. Uh, as well. This is the Junior's Batman, so we'll put him together, but he's actually a pretty good find as well. We'll put him down there. Uh, we're starting to see why I'm doing pretty well on this. We have the Joker, uh, another Joker, and here's his uh, coattails. I think these go with him as well. 
Uh, there's another Batman that is one of the first versions of Batman ever created, and that is a good find too. Just make sure he's real. Oh, he's a magnet. Okay. Uh, eh, mm, eh, mm. We do sell those as magnets, so I'll put him kind of halfway up here and halfway not. Not as good as if he wasn't a magnet. Guessing this guy's a magnet too. Yeah, nope. This guy's actually real. So there's a good, nice ting there too. 14, 15 bucks uh, on that Batman. Don't know what that one is, but he's holding Thor's hammer, so he must be worthy, uh, I suppose. We'll put this on. What? Oh, it goes like this. Or like this. Yeah, like this. Part of his hammer. There we go. Uh, not sure. Loki. Man Bat, of course. Gotta have Man Bat. Uh, here is supposed to be uh, Thor from Thor Ragnarok. Wrong headpiece, though, so we'll have to look in here if we have the right headpiece, which we probably do. That's a great find as well. We need his helmet. That's the hardest thing to find. Uh, here is another one of those Batmans. One of the old school Batman, so that's a good one too. Good, good, good. Uh, not a magnet. Two Face, probably his most valuable form there as well. That's another solid ting. That one's not super good. This one's pretty good too. Uh, Bruce Wayne with the bow tie. That's actually a pretty good find as well. We'll put him down there. Uh, Joker from uh, the Arkham Asylum, the newer version of the Arkham Asylum. I don't think he's worth too much, the Joker in this one, but we'll see. Uh, here is a great find if it is real, which it is probably not. Nope, not real, just like it's always not real. <laughs> Space Iron Man, one of the uh, highly, highly faked figures of all time right there. We have She-Hulk, that's a pretty cool one. Don't usually get that very often. Here's a fake version of Deadpool. It is a good copy. Um, obviously, you can tell it's fake, though, because they never made that version. So right off the bat, we know that one is fake. Uh, there's actually a good headpiece. That's one of the valuable um, pilots from uh, Star Wars, and we also have some weapons that we can use for that. So not a complete loss there. Scarlet Witch again. We'll put her down here. Hawkeye, not much there. Uh, Iron Man Garbanon. Yep, didn't see that coming. We'll put Iron Man down here. Another one of these. Whoop, hello. Another one of these Junior's Batmans. Uh, I sell these all the time. Just don't sleep on them. The light blue. Light blue. That's what you look for. Uh, what the... I don't think that's his body for that head. I actually haven't seen that head before. I'm going to have to look that up. I don't know what head that is. It says it's Lego. Maybe it's custom printed, though. We'll have to take a look if I can find that one. Uh, we have Robin. Dark suit Robin there. Uh, this one... Jeez, were there some superheroes I have no idea about? Or some of these custom printed on Lego pieces, I wonder. No idea. Comment below if you know what that one is. We're going to put that one in the uh, research pile right here. Power Man again. We have Captain Marvel. I believe this is the one from... I think this is the newer one, so not super valuable on that one. Uh, here's Spider-Man 3 again. A little bit more complete than the other one was. Fantastic condition on this guy. Look at that. Not even any headwear or anything like that. Awesome find right there. I'll get it going in the ting pile there too. Uh, I think this one's actually a pretty good version of Mr. Freeze. I don't think he's a super ting, but we'll put him down there just because he's pretty cool. Don't know what that one is. I think it's from the Adventurers or something. Uh, we have Black Panther, RIP, Black Suit Spider-Man, that's a pretty good one, I sell that all the time, I think it's only like $10 though. Uh, we have Mary Jane, that's a good one too, from Spider-Man, uh, I, so. I think that's actually like $15 or so. Uh, Joker again, don't know what suit that is, maybe it's one of the um, CMF versions or something like that. Red Skull, wearing some kind of pants, short cape Robin, uh, interesting, interesting, way to wear your cape. Just, not. Let's put that over there. There's a Batgirl cape, so hopefully we can find one of her. One of the newer forms of Batman. I don't know what version or what uh, value that version has. An Adaptoid. We have Electro times two, looks like. Not a bad fig there either. These are all really, you know, solid, decent figs. Um, I don't know what that is, but I want to say Silver Centurion. Hopefully. I don't know. I don't know. I really don't know. Iron Man? Always good to get Iron Man. I'll take as many Iron Mans as I can possibly get. Uh, I think that's Commissioner Gordon's torso. We have two Outriders here with their backpacks. Here's another one of those capes for down here. Some Dimensions, Batman. Another Power Man. Vulture. Thor. Another Batman. Lex Luthor. <laughs> There's one of my favorite figs of all time, that version of Spider-Man. Ick. Another one of those. I don't know what that is, but there's another one. Somebody wanted a copper helmet, it looks like. <laughs> Rip. Uh, there's Batgirl. Torso, anyway. We'll have to put that one together. Nothing there. Nothing there. Just Batman. We got Rhino. 
I think that's a new Mr. Freeze. I haven't seen that one before, though. Iron Man again. Maybe it goes to Iron Man Garmadon. Nothing there. Iron Spider, I think, is what this one is called. Or no, Scarlet Spider. Wait, no. Scarlet Spider? I don't know. I don't remember. Some kind of Spider-Man. <laughs> or a woman. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> I have no idea. Uh, this looks like uh, it could possibly be Loki's cape from Ragnarok. Oh, is that what that one is? That torso from Loki from Ragnarok, possibly? That could be. There's his cape, I think. So we'll have to look into that, because that would make sense if we have Thor and uh, Hulk from Ragnarok. Uh, nothing there. Another black suit Spider-Man. What else we got? There's Loki's thing. Is this one real? There's a real one. We got a helmet for Scuba Iron Man. Don't see a Scuba Iron Man in here, though. Aquaman, the newer form from the movie. Superman, Superman. Nightwing, Mighty Mike Rose. Another Batman. Lex Luthor with his armor. Spider-Man. Oh, there's a good form of the Riddler. We just found him just recently, and there's another one of him, one of the classic versions of the Riddler. Totally good fig right there. Star-Lord's helmet. We'll put that down here as well. That's always good to find. There we go. That's the helmet we needed right there. We're going to have to find his head in here, hopefully, too. Uh, but that helmet, I will be able to make a uh, Ragnarok Thor regardless if we find that one or not. Uh, so that one's going to be a tremendous find right there. That Thor is going pretty well because everybody loves that movie. There we go. There we go. There we go. There you go. There you go. Um, Django Fett? I think. I think. Falcon? Catwoman? Super cool Joker hat, I guess. <laughs> I'm not sure. Another Joker hat. Uh, what else we got? What else we got? Mr. Freeze. These are all just headpieces. Uh, hopefully we find that Thor piece. That would be cool. There's Bane. Uh, there's actually Yondu as well. I didn't see Yondu's torso. Maybe it was in here somewhere. Um, but anyways, a lot of good pieces we'll be able to use. No problem. They drew on Catwoman, unfortunately. Don't know why, but they did. Drawn on or chewed on. You can pick whichever one you choose. <laughs> Here's also some uh, pieces to a what is this, a Doc Ock, I think? Something like that. We also do have another cape, uh, which just looks like a red cape. Brand new, though. Brand new red cape. If you want it, brand new. And I think that's it. I think that's going to do it. A, some wings for the Adaptoid, probably. Uh, but yeah, comment below what your favorite was. We got tons and tons and tons and tons of tings. Tell me what this is, because I have no idea whatsoever. It looks like some kind of henchman of something. I'm not sure, though. Maybe one of the newer figures. Uh, what is my favorite of today? This guy. That guy. So cool. So good. So good. All right, everybody. Love you. Smash all the buttons. Share with your friends. We're going to sort this, and I'll catch you on the next one.